Hey guys, this is Michael from Stillwell Pianos in Mesa, Arizona, and I'm standing right in front of this 1977 Schimmel Grand Piano. This is a six-foot Schimmel, and Schimmels are a really um, unique piano for us because they are German, um, but they're a fairly big company, um, and they're fairly well represented in the United States, so we see them a little bit more often than we see other uh, German brands like Bluten or Beckstein um, and some of those Pleyel and stuff like that. So. Um, but I wanted to show you a little bit more in depth into this piano. Schimmel was started in 1885 in Germany, and it is still to this day uh, owned majority by family and ran by family. And um, in my opinion, when stuff like that is done, including our business, um, they tend to uh, pay attention a little bit more to detail. So one thing I wanted to show you guys is us technicians have to deal with a lot of old pianos. And what we don't like about old pianos is when wood gets brittle. So this is a cheek block of another brand of a piano. I won't say which one. Some of you technicians might be able to figure it out from that, <laughs> that code right there, but our serial number. But this is from the Schimmel. And as you can see, this female is threaded. So this is the cheek blocks that go on the sides of the keys. And this is threaded. This makes this 10 times easier for us technicians because what happens in old pianos a lot of times, like in this brand, is after years and years of us taking this wood screw out, this is not threaded, this is just a piece of wood that's threaded, there's no female in there. So after years and years of doing this, this starts to deteriorate. And what we do is we just start putting in bigger screws, sometimes we'll plug those holes. But Shimwa has gone a little bit further and really established themselves as a heirloom brand and has done something like this, it's a permanent fix from day one. Um, and that's just kind of just a, I, just to show you how they are paying attention, this stuff is hidden. This stuff is only good for us technicians. Um, they do use a whole runner action as well, too. You can see the runner um, hammer rail right here. What we've done to this piano is we've just gone through and hyper-regulated it. We've voiced it. We've shaped the hammers, um, and we've just kind of dialed it in. It's a 1977 piano, so we really didn't need to rebuild it as much as just kind of touch up the cabinet as much as we could, um, regulate the action. I think we rebushed a couple center pins, um, re-rubbed out the piano, and just basically dialed it in for you guys. So now let's hear uh, Nicole play it for us. And uh, if you have any questions, always feel free to shoot me an email at michael at stillwellpianos.com. Thanks for watching, guys.